When I walked through Tell Dan, I was simply amazed by a number of things. One, its beauty. All around this ancient tell is some beautiful flora and fauna that is fed by a beautiful spring that comes out at the base of Mount Hermon. It's a very tropical environment, an environment that really a lot of people don't think of when they envision the Bible lands. But not only was Tell Dan remarkable to me because of its beauty, but I was impressed because of the archaeology that has unearthed a number of things there over the years that really helped prove and demonstrate the Bible's verity, its truthfulness, to help us to realize that when Abraham, who sojourned through the Bible lands and later on came here and rescued his nephew Lot, that these are real places that you can actually go and visit them, just as the Bible describes. But then number three, in contrast to the beauty of this place, Really, it was a grotesque place to me in a lot of ways because of the idolatry that was practiced there, because of the sin that was committed there.